back with a new video. It's me, Tima, and I'm gonna be doing this hair review today on Clay Yi Hair. I'm gonna get into the styling first before we do anything, and this is gonna be a back to schoolish video. I've already done two back to school videos, but if you're already in school, which I'm sure most people already are right now, I'm a little bit late with this one, but again, it's gonna be just a wig that you can wear to school from here on out. We're gonna get into the styling and the installation of this wig first, and then get into the styles afterwards. Okay, so I just finished laying down my wig. Unfortunately, I do not have my got to be glued spray. I'll be getting it from my friend's house really soon, but in this case, I actually don't need it at all for this wig because um, just the way it's made and also the elastic band that I used is adhered to my head, like it fits perfectly, so I don't have to worry about anything. And also, like, I wanted to show you guys um, success of bleaching the knots. So I'm gonna kind of just move the comb this way so y'all can see like if I were to put my hair in a ponytail or something you could still see the fake scalp but far enough to where it does look pretty realistic pretty realistic if I were to like move it up or anything it would look pretty natural and I want to say too I've already washed this hair and it is super soft you guys I've already done like two back to school videos which is more than enough but I do want to put this one in there just because it is so natural looking and it just honestly looks so good. I also plucked um, the unit myself. Put some water in your hand and this just kind of like move back and just lay this flat. And then what I'm gonna also do is put um, more of this mousse on here. I'll go ahead and do my makeup off camera for you guys and then come back and do the hairstyle and also talk more about this unit. So stay tuned for that. Yeah, so my eyes might look bare, but I did put on some mascara for you guys. I'm not wearing any lashes. I've just been using the Rimmel London uh, Lash Accelerator Serum. Yeah, let's really get into this hair now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to um, shape it around my face better as well as cutting it a little bit shorter. Uh, I do prefer this because whenever I do this, my wigs just look so much more natural and I get way more compliments on them whenever I use this method. So yeah, I think this side already looks a lot better. It looks more natural. I'm gonna kind of thin this out just a little bit more. Wow. Yeah, just so I can just like Move my hair like this, like it's a lot lighter, more than it being heavy, like around your face.
Okay, so if you're just leaving the hair down, this is what it looks like. Um, I really love how the ends look too. They just curl up very nicely. So this is more of like a jerry curl, deep curly wig. But I really like the length of this. I love the hair itself. I love the knots and everything. Of course, I could go in and make this the lace lighter, but no one's gonna be that close up to my face anyway, so that's fine. But this is how it's looking. I think it looks really, really good. I'm gonna go into the specs of this wig now, and then we're gonna do a couple, just two different styles. Okay, my camera shut up on me. I freaking hate this when it does that. But anyways, um, so I got this hair in a 24 inch and is 180 percent for the density so it is super thick i like my wigs to be on the thicker side when they're curly just because i think it just looks really beautiful that way and if you want to you can go ahead and just like take some lengths off or i guess use like a razor comb and just like make it thinner but i prefer this thickness this is how it is looking from the back and this is a lace front unit. I already put an elastic band in the back just to really make it to where it blends in very well. But this looks better, I guess, for now. Um, but yeah, I went ahead and I bleached the knots and everything. I did put foundation on the lace the other day, which was probably a bit darker than it should have been. But you don't really know until you try on the wig and put it on. So um, Also, the lace is a 13 by 4, so it goes back pretty far, which is great. I've already washed the hair once. 180% density, a 24 inch wig, and the 13 by 4 lace unit. It's gonna be $251.15. But yeah, I'm gonna go in right now and just style the other two styles, and then we'll be done with this video. Okay, so I'm wearing this like Washington State crop, but I cut off the university part, so um, Is it Washington? Yeah, no, it's Washington and Lee University, but yo, this looks so freaking cute I think like I actually like this style. It just reminds me of just a super 90s type of look I'm probably gonna put this in a bun next so y'all can see how it looks done up like that But wow, I would wear it just like this. The curls are just phenomenal. Like they look so good all right, let's get into the next hairstyle. This is the look with just the bun. I don't care if it looks crazy. I kind of actually like, it's still a look. And it was really easy for me to do. So like, if I wanted to, I could just put some, some hair on the side here and just like, yeah, just make it look really cute. Especially just with this length and everything, wow. Yeah, I like this. I think it looks great. Like this just looks so good, natural. I like how everything is looking in the front here. Okay, I'm gonna go take a picture now. My last look is gonna just be me, kind of. Well, I'm gonna take this out first. I'm gonna just do like a slick, well, the slickest ponytail that I could possibly do. Oh my god y'all this is so cute and it looks so flat because my braids honestly look really flat wow this wig looks so good y'all need to get your hands on this and i rarely get this excited about a wig that i'm wearing but when i can do a style like this then you know that's this is the wig for y'all hands down i like having a little bit of hair in the front too i think it looks really cute that way and this just looks like it would be cute for school and also for traveling
Again, the wig is $251.15 uh, for this unit. It's super versatile, you guys. It can look super laid depending on how you do your braids. I probably have around maybe like 10 underneath here, just going all the way down because I have a lot of hair going on. So yeah, this just looks so good. Like I cannot believe it. That is it for this video. I hope that you guys liked it and I will talk to you later. Bye guys, remember all the links below to Clay Your Hair is below. Be sure to go ahead and check them out. Check out my Patreon as well and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.